hey guys good evening welcome back again to my channel you guys hmm daddy you're dirty go and clean your mouth go and clean your mouth hmm clean your mouth you come here <laughs> you guys how are you all doing good beautiful evening today is what is today okay today is tuesday and modern sunday is over you guys our modern sunday is over <laughs> guys it has been something else anyway if you're meeting me for the first time don't forget to hit your red subscribe button like and share any video you found interesting here because we are giving you village vlogs raw village vlogs at as it is okay here in the village that is what i'm bringing to you so please subscribe okay let's run my intro so guys um as you can see the weather is coming down it's evening here so um i want to go and cook soup but I'm waiting for my girl. She's preparing the snail that I will use. I'm making vegetable soup. But my battery is down. I don't know if this battery will be enough for me to film that soup. But however, I will still show you the ones I can, okay, before our battery dies. I need to check a Jimmy or Jimmy, then we'll own the generator. We don't have that money to be spending on fuel. So we own it judiciously and also use it righteously. <laughs> I decided to open up this vlog here because I think this is the best time to open up another vlog. Yeah. So stay tuned and enjoy the rest of the vlog. look of our soup at the point of making this soup my battery died so that was why i couldn't finish the whole filming but yeah this is it this is the next day and i want to eat mine now i didn't eat it yesterday so yeah come and join me hey guys good morning you guys i'm going out it's a beautiful morning see i don't even know what i'm saying at this point but it's a beautiful morning and i'm going to my farm yeah i'm driving i want to go and give food to somebody that is working for me in my farm that place is a very big farm so i'll carry you guys along um i had my breakfast you guys i couldn't resist that my soup like i don't know what is happening to me after cooking i won't be able to eat that time i cooked but after some hours or maybe the next day the way that thing will be hungering me <laughs> It has not really been lit for the past how many years? But yeah, I ate eba this morning. I ate that soup with hot eba this morning. I am, I am full. I am energetic right now. So I'm heading over to my farm. I'm taking food to somebody that is working for me. He's like, that place has been cleared and burnt. Yeah, I'm am Casey. Guys, I don't know how to say it, but just know that that place has been okay i saw like the honor i go ahead i saw like then i make while you the place has been burnt so it's remaining the some of the little little things around the farm before it will be 
med ridges abby yes so i'm going there now the gear the guy is clearing it i want to go and give him food Guys, I can't see anybody here. I don't know. I'm in my farm, but I can't sight a single soul here. I don't know. I wish he did not come. Let me go and check. Victor. Okay, now. Nah. He's here. You guys, um, I've seen him and he's still busy. This is the whole farm. This is the whole farm and he's been doing what he can. He's been trying his best. He's doing a neat job, you guys. The people that will make the ridges won't find it difficult to make, to like do the job. So he's, he's doing a neat job, yeah. I'm about going now. I gathered the firewood that he fetched for me. And I've tied it. We are going to put it inside the car. Yeah, I go. So yeah, I just want to show you guys. Okay, let me show you. Let me flip up the camera so that you see the whole farm. So this is the whole farm. So all this place has been done. All this place has been done. So guys, I'm going home right now. I came to give him his food. And yeah, luckily for me, he got some firewood for me also. So I also picked some palm kernel that I will crack at home and eat. So let's go home, guys. I'm so tired. I'm very, very tired. But yeah, let's head home. When he's done, he will start coming home. You all, this is my firewood. I'm set to go home. Can you see? A lot of firewood. The boy but are amazing. Honestly speaking. I'm so happy. Guys, let's go home. Hey specials, what's up? How are you all doing? You guys don't mind my tired face. I just came back from the farm right now. I went to see... Guys, my husband is leaving. Sorry. I went to see the guy that um, was clearing my farm for me. And then I came back. I've taken my bed. And I was just going through my phone, through my Facebook page. And I saw something. See, I know I've said a, I know I've said a lot concerning this issue now on this my channel so i didn't feel like coming to do another a whole video on this topic i just wanted to throw in and i just wanted to throw in a light on it maybe just put in my mouth just say one or two on this issue now i saw a video of somebody the person that posted it was um comedian sa one on one something like that Sa one on one he's a comedian so he posted on his page on his facebook page guys a young girl a young girl of 14 years a young girl of 14 years being locked out on the code maybe this thing happened last night according to them they said they were coming back from like they went to drop a colleague of theirs in her house then when they passed they saw that girl on their gate, like standing at the gate. They were moved to stop and then asked the girl what was happening. The girl said that her madam sent her out to go and buy a drink for her. Now that she is back, this woman locked her up. Like the woman locked her outside. Listen, as at the time they were making that video, it was around 1 a.m. in the morning. Now this girl has like the madam's husband is maybe he he's a politician he travels 
outside the state and still comes back. Now, on that night, the man came back from one of his travels and he asked of the girl. The wife told him that their help is sleeping in the room. This man went upstairs, took his bed and maybe went to sleep. Oh, see, the type of knock that he heard from his gates. These guys now, we are knocking. They did the video. Guys, I don't want to post this video here. Can YouTube hurry come for me? I don't want anybody to come for me. When I forgot no mommy, a local woman trying to grow my channel. I've not I'm not even monetized. So I don't have that right to post any video. But I'll just leave a picture here. Okay? I'll leave a picture of the things I screenshotted here. Imagine. This man heard the knock from the gate. He came down and then he opened the gate and saw these people. They explained why they knocked on his gate. He now saw his help. This man was the person that opened his mouth and said that his own wife is wicked. That when he came back, that his little son was downloading him what the type of treatment the mother have been giving to that girl. If you know you cannot relate another person's child, why not leave them in their mother's house? Mothers! Please keep your children. Scrutinize the type of person you are giving your child to. They will kill your child one day. I don't know why women have this naive and ignorance. Like, eh? I See, guys, after watching this video, I literally shed tears. Like, my husband came and started asking me, what is the problem? And I'm like, help. I have a help. She's 21. She will turn 21 by May. May 4th. She will be either 20 or 21. No, May 24th. Yes, May 24th. She will turn either 20. I should even do a video with her. Yes, I should do a video with her. I have a help. But if you're not from, like, if you don't live here, if you just see her on the road, and maybe you come here in my house and you see her, you will think she's my junior sister. You will think, we don't have much. We don't even have anything. But I treat her the way I treat myself. I make her comfortable. I have never laid my hand on that girl since last year, February, she came to stay with me. Not that she hasn't been doing something bad. Not that she hasn't, she hasn't been offending me, no. But because I treat her the way I treat my children, because I am a human being, because she's a human being, because she has blood flowing through her veins. Because I have conscience. Because I know that there is karma. If you know you cannot relate another person's child, gently leave them in their mother's house. You mothers, try to scrutinize the type of person you are leaving your child with. Try to scrutinize the type of women you are giving out your children to. Some are wolves in sheep's clothing, Abby. Yes, some of, uh, so, some of us women, they are wolves in sheep's clothing. You won't know. Some are chameleon, green snake in the green grass. You don't want to give out your child and then they will go and disfigure your, ch uh, your daughter one day in the name of you, we don't have money. In the name of we can't even feed. Rewe water leave. Sell pure water. Women go through a lot just to make sure that their children feed well. Women, that is why you are a mother. Women go through a lot just to make sure that their family is in order. That is why you are a mother. Fend for your child. Let your child know that you suffered for the, him or her. Not sending them out with, a, with your left hand and then leaving them to die there. Guys, uh, I just came here to just say one or two about this whole thing. Women, please. Please, this video is already long. Please. Please. Let us treat other people's kids the way we treat our own. Let us be at least nice. How can you lock somebody? What if she, what if she, she was raped? What if she's been kidnapped? What if she's been, she's been murdered and her parts taken? Then you will look for one allegation and the hip on her head. Maybe you will tell us she's not a good girl. Maybe you will tell us she went out clubbing. Let us fear God. Everything we are doing in this life. Let us remember that one day we will give an account of how we, how we spent our, how we, let us fear God. Let us fear God. Let us fear God. Guys, this is the end of my video. I'm so sorry I'm ending it on this note, but please, women, let us be careful. Yes. 
thank you for watching hope you enjoyed watching this village vlog this village local woman hope you enjoyed my video of course i know you did don't forget to hit the red subscribe button like and share any video you found interesting here and of course i'll see you again in another video for now bye